women on average look more attractive than men do in terms of overall facial attractiveness and averageness. And this is due to an advantage women possess that men don't have, that advantage being neoteny. In today's video, in short format, we will discuss why neoteny is such a big advantage for women and if that advantage can also be used by men as well to enhance their facial attractiveness. This video, like many others, will be split into two main parts. In the first part, we will discuss and explain what is neoteny, and in the second one, we will compare neoteny in men versus neoteny in women, and their advantages. If you want to support the channel and get your face evaluated by me with personalized look max and advice, link will be down in the description. If you want to read more about topics like these, you can check out my blog at neofacebration.com. Without further ado, let's get this video started. Neoteny is a term that refers to the retention of juvenile or childish features into adulthood. It is derived from the Greek word neo, meaning new, and tianin, meaning to extend. Neoteny is a form of heterochrony, which is a change in the timing of the rate of development of an organism relative to its ancestor. Neoteny is especially evident in humans, who have many physical and behavioral traits that are typically found in young animals, such as large brain, if large face, a small nose, a hairless body, and a high degree of learning and sociality. However, neoteny is not equally distributed among humans. There are significant differences in the degree of neoteny between sexes, races, and individuals. In general, females are more neotenous than males in appearance, mentality, and behavior. This means that females tend to have more features that are associated with youthfulness, such as large eyes, full lips, round cheeks, small chin, soft skin, and a high-pitched voice. These features are considered cute and are often enhanced by makeup, hairstyles, and clothing. Neoteny can never look good on a man because the baby-faced look on men gives the image of lack of responsibility, lack of sexual masculine dimorphism that makes men attractive, inability to provide and protect, and lack of maturity plus more. So neoteny ruins male attractiveness and their sex appeal. But why are neoteny's features attractive in females? There are several possible explanations based on evolutionary biological and psychological perspectives. One explanation is that neoteny signals fertility, health, and genetic quality. Females who look young and baby-like may indicate that they are old enough to reproduce but young enough to have healthy offsprings. They may also suggest that they have good genes that slow down the aging process and prevent diseases. Another explanation is that neoteny elicits parental care and protection. Females who look like children may trigger the innate nurturing and protective instincts of males, who are more likely to provide them with resources and security. They may also evoke positive emotions such as affection, empathy, and loyalty, that facilitates bonding and cooperation. It hides the sneakiness of a female. A third explanation is that neoteny reflects personality and behavior. Females who look innocent and playful may imply that they are friendly, cheerful, and fun and loving. They may also indicate that they are submissive, agreeable, and loyal, which are desirable traits for a long-term partner. It is important to note that females can still be attractive without neoteny. Here is Adriana Lima and Giselle. Both of them have low neoteny, but they have high facial harmony and sharp features. Still, they will look more dominant. So, for women, they can look max with the goal to enhance their neoteny, making them benefit from it. As for men, they should look max to remove it and to get away from a baby-faced appearance. But what do you guys think about all of this? Let me know your thoughts down in the comment section. That's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. A like and subscribe would be highly appreciated. And like usual, catch you guys in the next one.